Welcome to Pilates on the Green. It is such a beautiful morning. We have beauty of the golf course. We have the ambient sound of the fountains in the background. Plus, we have the blue sky and the sun. We are under the shade here, but it's really just a fabulous morning and a great way to start your day. We're doing Pilates here on the Green, and today we're going to be using uh, two items that are in our fit. This way you can use them in a different than the hands, balls, and balance class. So um, just, I just want you to sit up nice and tall. Make sure those shoulders are above your hips and your chin is parallel to the floor. Inhale through your nose, pulling that belly button in. And as you exhale, I want you to slowly exhale through your mouth, but pull the belly button tighter. Inhale through the nose. Abs are engaged. As you exhale forcefully through the mouth, I want you to pull the belly button a lot tighter to your spine. We'll do one more time like that. Inhaling through the nose. Exhale, belly button tighter. Nice work. Okay, so we're gonna start off with the ball. And I'm going to turn around, so grab your ball, and we're just gonna put that ball in the small of our back or down by your tailbone here. <clears throat> we're gonna sit up nice and tall. Those arms are in front of you. Pull that belly button in. Chin is parallel to the floor. Sitting up tall here, inhaling. As you exhale, go ahead and lean back into that ball. Keep that belly button in. And it, that ball is kind of like a little massage here, and it feels fabulous. As you exhale, pull the belly button in. Inhale here. Exhale, use those abs to sit up nice and tall. Inhale. Exhale, go ahead and lean back into that ball. Inhale. Exhale, pull those abs in. Use those abs to lift. We'll do two more here. Inhale. Exhale, lean back into that ball. Inhale, exhale, sitting up nice and tall. Now make sure that posture is long and tall. Inhale here, exhale, lean back. Now we're gonna hold it here. Take that right hand, inhale, exhale, rotate that right arm behind you. As you look at that right palm, inhale, bring that right arm in and sit up nice and tall as you exhale. Inhale here, exhale, lean back. Bring that left arm behind you as you look at that left thumb. Inhale, bring it back in. Exhale, sit up nice and tall. Inhale, lean back, abs in. Exhale, rotate. Bring it forward, sit up tall. And last time, exhale. Inhale, bring it forward, shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, sit up nice and tall. Now we're going to grab the ball. This time you're not going to have that support. However, if you need it, go ahead. Keep that ball right where it is. I'm going to hold on to the ball. Again, my posture is nice and tall. Inhale here, belly button's engaged. As you exhale, lean back into that. Release the ball, right hand. Inhale, left hand. Exhale, inhale. Exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, that core is engaged, we'll do two more each side, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, You grab onto the ball, inhale here, abs are engaged, exhale. Sitting up nice and tall, fabulous. You should have felt that in that core. Okay, we're gonna move on. We're gonna put that ball between our thighs. My legs are gonna stay bent, arms are engaged. This time we're gonna roll all the way down. 
Well, let's just start with little half rollbacks. So pull the belly button in here, inhale. Exhale, tuck that chin, round out those shoulders. We're rolling back. Inhale. And you're squeezing that ball as we sit up nice and tall. Inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Sitting up tall. Now remember, when we're exhaling, that's when we pull that belly button in. Inhale. Exhale. And last time here. Inhale, sitting up tall. Exhale, roll back. Hold it here, keep breathing, those abs are engaged. Here's five, four, three, two, I'm squeezing the ball, and inhale, exhale. Really, engage that core, sit up tall. Nice job. Now this time we're gonna roll all the way down, so make sure you have room to lay on the back of your mat. Inhaling here, exhale. The belly button's pulled to the spine. Low in control, one vertebra at a time. We're reaching those arms up, get a nice little stretch here, and then circle those arms all the way down. Let's walk those feet closer to your butt. Now we've got that ball in between those knees, or in between your thighs. We're gonna begin with some bridges. So, I just want you to see I've got that neutral spine right here. Arms are down by my side. My shoulders are away from the ears. I'm going to keep a fist distance between my chin and my chest. Inhale here and prepare. As you exhale, keep a little pelvic tilt, and then the belly button's engaged. You're pushing through those heels, lifting the hips, and then one vertebra at a time. At the top, you're squeezing that ball. And breathe. The belly button's in. Inhale here. Exhale. Slowly lower, one vertebra at a time. Inhale here and prepare. Exhale, a little pelvic tilt, that belly button's in. Pushing through your heels. Now maybe you wanna have your hands here just to give yourself a little more challenge. Again, that fist distance is in between your chin and chest. Inhaling at the top, the core's in. Shoulders away from the ears, exhale. And slowly lower. We're still squeezing that ball between the thighs. You're working those adductors. Here's another option. Inhale here and prepare. Exhale, little pelvic tilt. Reaching those arms up. Squeezing those thighs together. Squeeze your butt. Squeeze your hamstrings. Squeeze that core. So we got that whole body working. Those abdominals are engaged, and we're working on that low back as well. Push those shoulders into the mat. Inhaling here. Exhale, and slowly lower. One vertebra at a time, and one more time here with the ball. Inhale here and prepare. Exhale, little pelvic tilt. Pushing through those heels, lifting up those arms only as an option. Now we're gonna hold it here. Tiny little squeezes with our knees. Squeeze, squeeze, we're tiny pulsing here. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Give me eight more, come on, you can do this. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two. Hold the squeeze, five, four, Three, two, one, inhaling, exhale, slowly lower, lowering those hands, nice, go ahead and lift up those legs, we're just going to put that ball off to the side, not too far away from us, now we're going to take that band, go ahead and put it on your thighs, just above those knees. We're not done with our bridges because we just worked those adductors, the inner thighs. Now we're gonna work those abductors, the outer thighs. Again, we're getting all kinds of activity and toning going on right here. Now, hands by your side, shoulders away from your ears, heels close to the butt. Pull the belly button in. Shoulders away, retracted shoulders, pushing them into the mat, the shoulder blades. Inhale here. See how I have that neutral spine? Exhale, 
give me a little pelvic tilt, pushing into the heels and push those hips up. Breathing into that, squeezing the butt, hamstrings. Inhaling at the top, exhale, slowly lower, one vertebra at a time, bringing those hips all the way down. Good. Inhale here and prepare. Exhale, go ahead, little pelvic tilt. Now remember, you can always keep those hands here, or you can keep those hands here. More challenging is having these arms just above your chest. Squeeze that butt, pull the belly button in, inhaling at the top, exhale, and slowly lower. Be mindful here, kids, that you're not resting on your head and neck. You're just resting on those shoulders. Inhale here and prepare. Exhale, go ahead, push. Give me that little pelvic tilt, pushing those hips up. You're pushing into your heels. Now we're gonna hold it here. We're squeezing that butt cheek. We're activating those hamstrings. That belly button is supporting that low back. Now we're gonna pulse those legs out to the side. Here's eight. Pulse them out. Give me eight more. Here's eight, seven, six, five. Keep those hips lifted. Three, two, one, tiny pulse, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, eight more, seven, six, five, four, three, two, hold it out there, five, four, three, two, one, bring those knees together, inhaling, add still in, exhale, and slowly lower all the way down. Fabulous, kids. Go ahead and get your drinks as needed. Since we have a band, we're going to move the band down toward our feet. And I want you to place them kind of like underneath the arch of the foot so you have it securely underneath your feet. Pull that belly button in. Those shoulders are away from your ears. I've got my imprinted spine. That means I cannot put my hand through my low back. Just make sure that you keep those knees above your hips. So what we'll do is we'll push that right leg away from you, keeping that left leg just above tabletop. Now flex that right foot, push, and pull those knees in. That left leg stays straight, exhale, push, belly button into the spine, and pull it back in. Exhale. Now you can always keep the head, neck, and shoulders onto the mat. This is your easier option. If you want to get more activity with the core, lift the head, neck, and shoulders. That left leg is straight, but it's still active right here. You're extending that right leg. You can always rest your head in your hands. Low back stays into the mat. That belly button is active. Give me one more here. And now tiny pulse. Eight, seven, six, four, three, two. Bring it in slow. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Even though that right leg was working, this left leg felt some love with an isometric hold. Now we're going to extend that left leg, okay? Keep that low back into the mat. Let's extend that right knee just above your hip. And inhale, bring it back in. Low back stays into the mat, pull the core in. Three. Two. Last one, now tiny pulse. You're pushing that left foot forward. Eight. Six. Four. Three. Two. Hold and squeeze. Five, four. Three, two, one. That low back stays into the mat. Slowly bring it in. Ooh. Nice. Go ahead and hug those knees into your chest and rock it side to side. Massaging that spine. Go ahead and 
put that hand off to the side. We're going to go back to the ball. Because I like to work the lower part of the abdominals first before we move on to anything else. So we're going to put that ball between, just above our ankles, but between our legs. And here it's critical. Guys, it's critical to keep that low back into the mat because we're going to lower and lift the legs. Sometimes we have the um, tendency to arch our back. And when we do that, you're lowering your legs too low. Okay? So make sure you keep the low back into the mat to protect that low back. This exercise is going to work that area of the abdominals below the belly button, the lower part of those abs, that little pooch area that we eat, right? Alrighty, so you're extending those legs just above your hips. Pull that belly button in. You can have your head, neck, and shoulders lifted if you want to, otherwise just stay here. But keep the low back into the mat. Inhale, lower those legs. Only until to the part where you can still that, that low back is into the mat. Exhale, use those abs to lift. Good. Inhale and lower. Belly button in. Exhale. Use those abs. Use those abs. Inhale. Exhale. Again, keep that low back into the mat. Shoulders away from your ears. Inhale. Exhale. So you're lifting those legs not from your hip flexors from the lower part of those abdominals. Really engaging that re uh, transverse abdominus. Let's do four more here. Inhale. One more. Inhale. Now hold it here. Hold it here. Deep breathe. Five, four, three, two. Feel the love. One. Lift. Exhaling. Exhaling. Using that core. Oh, nice job. Okay, so let's bend both of those legs. Bring them to tabletop. We'll place that ball on that right thigh. You're going to take your left hand, placing it on the ball. Once again, I've got that imprinted spine. My low back is into the mat. I'm going to extend this left leg out. I'm going to keep my right knee bent. Simultaneously, I'm going to push my left hand into the ball as my right thigh pushes back away from the ball, okay? Or, or pushes back into the ball. So we've got a pushing in both directions with this right leg. On the same, at the same time, we're going to inhale, lower that left leg, exhale, flex and lift, point and lower, flex and lift. So we got a lot going on. We've got that activity in that right leg, abs engage, exhale and lift, point and lower, low back into the mat, exhale. So if your lowering is here, that's fine. Keep that low back into the mat. Exhale and lift. Give me four more. Point and lower. Exhale and lift. Now, you're going to flex and lower. You're still pushing that hand into the ball. Point and lift. Flex and lower. Point and lift. Flex and lower. Point and lift. And lift, flex and lower, point and lift. Woo. Now you felt that below the belly button, you might have felt it right here in those obliques. We're going to do the same thing now. Left thigh, right hand on the ball. You can bring that left hand behind you. So you're going to keep left knee bent. Once again, you're pushing the hand into the ball. You're pushing the leg into the ball, so it's constant contraction right here, and you've got activity with that right leg. All right, so we're going to point and lower that right leg. Exhale, flex, use the abdominals to lift. Point and lower, flex, and lift. Keep that low back into the mat. Flex and lift. Lower, exhale, exhale, 
flex and lift. I'm feeling it all across those abs. Point and lower, flex and lift. Now we're gonna flex and lower, inhale, point ex and exhale and lift. Flex and lower, low back, face into the mat. Point and lift. Flex and lower, point and lift. Last time, flex and lower, point and lift. Ooh. Feel the love, kids. Alrighty, go ahead and put those feet down. And then <clears throat> extend those legs. We're gonna do some roll-ups here with our ball. We're gonna start nice stretch here, just stretching out the, the whole body, the front of your body and the back of your body. So Pull the belly button in. Inhale, I'm starting off with that neutral spine. I can put my hand through my low back. Inhale here, lift the head, neck and shoulders. As you exhale, pull that belly button in. Sitting up nice and tall, reaching forward. Inhale, sit up tall. Exhale, slowly lower. Now your option. You do not have to use that ball if you need to. Inhale here. Grab behind those thighs. To pull yourself up and then reach forward. Use control, stacking the vertebra on top of each other. Exhale and slowly lower. Okay, that was your easy option. Inhale here. Exhale. Reaching forward. Sit up tall as we stack the vertebra on top of each other. Exhale and slowly low. We'll do four more. Oh, let's just do two more here. Inhale here. Exhale and lift. Inhale. Exhale, belly button still pull to the spine. We're controlling our way down. We've got one more. Inhale, exhale, reaching it forward, inhale here, now that ball is between those, uh, the base of the fingers, lower those arms, keep them away from your chest, we're going to do some chest work, so go ahead, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze that ball, so just so you can see what I'm doing, squeeze, squeeze, Good, good. Sit up tall. Eight. Four. Give me eight more. Here's eight. Keep those elbows off your chest. Three, two, one. Hold it in here. Bring those arms up and down. Up and down. And inhale, exhale. No, exhale. That belly button's in. Notice your posture. Give me four more. Four. Three. Two. Nice job. Hold it up there. Five, four. Three, two, one. And lower. Good. Now place that ball off to the side. Grab your band. I want, to, want you to put it like this. Just above those wrists. Okay, now we're going to extend those arms and slowly roll back. We're going to continue with our roll-ups. Now I want you to keep opening up those arms out to the side. Arms overhead. Inhale here and prepare. Lifting head, neck, and shoulders. Exhale. Keep the tension on that band. Reach forward. Inhale. Exhale, slowly lower. Inhale and prepare. Opening up those arms. Exhale. Reach it forward. Inhale. Exhale, slowly lower. Now give me two more here, guys. Inhale and prepare. Exhale. Reach it forward. Inhale, stacking the vertebra on top of each other. Exhale and lower. And give me 
one more. Inhale here and prepare. Belly button in, low back into the mat, imprint the spine. Exhale, use that core. Reach it forward. Inhale up. Exhale and lower. Good. Go ahead and roll yourself up. Now we're going to keep that band on our wrists. We're going to roll over onto all fours. Now we're going to do some push-ups here, guys. I want you to keep those arms extended so you have the tension on the band, okay? You can always do your push-ups on your knees, but you're not here, right? You're on an incline. I don't want you to sink the hips. You're not here either. Or you can do it on your toes. Pick the option. Pull that belly button in. Go ahead and open up that right arm. Pull it back in. Give me a push-up. Right arm, again. Push up here. And bring it back in. Right arm. Push up. Bring it back in. Last time, right arm. Push up. Bring it back in. Good, now left arm. Out. Push up. And bring it back in. Remember your options, you can always come to your knees. Push up. Bring it back in. Keep that core engaged. Don't let those hips sink. Out. Push up. Bring it back in. One more time here, guys. Out. Push up. Bring it back in. Good. Lower those knees. Sit back on your heels. Yes, you probably felt that up here in your deltoids. Just sit back on those heels. Good. Now, on to your right side. Your band. We're going to keep it just below, just above those ankles. Push yourself to the back part of the mat. Stack those hips on top of each other. Rest your head in your hand. Now go ahead and lift both of those legs, bringing them to the front corner. Belly button in. Lift and lower. Now, you're working that saddlebag area here. The whole thing is we don't want you to have those hips forward and we don't want you to stay in that, on that bottom hip, tilting it back. You've got to keep that belly button in for stabilization here, stacking those hips on top of each other. Give me eight, seven, four, Three, two, hold it up, there's three pulse. There's eight, seven, six, five, four, two, and nice job. Now, keep that leg lifted, you're feeling the loves. Kick forward, point the toe, bring it back. Kick forward, point and bring it back. Forward, point, and bring back. Squeeze that butt cheek. Forward, point, and bring it back. You definitely are feeling the love. All right, lower that leg, then those knees. Now we're gonna bring that band up above those knees. Bring your knees in. Lift your chest so you're an L here. Keep those heels and ankles together. Keep the heels together. We're just going to lift that top leg and lower. Okay? Feel that love. I just love it so much. Exhale. That core is in. Navel to the spine. Hold it up there. Give me tiny pulses. We've got eight more. Stay with me. Stay strong. You can do this. Last one. Hold it. Push them out. Five. 
lower. Ooh, fabulous. So go ahead, push yourself up. Let's bring it over to the other side quickly. Good morning. Yes, we are. Pilates on the green. Pilates is what we're doing. Website is LWCA Fitness. YouTube channel. Okay, so once again, the band is above the ankle. We will bring both of those legs to the front corner like a banana. Hips are stacked on top of each other. You can either be here, resting your head in your hand, or down here, whatever is comfortable for you. Now, that top leg, foot flex, lift, and lower. Good. Watch that you're not walking here. You're not here doing it. Everything is stacked. Three, two, one. Hold it up there. Tiny pulse. That's in. We've got eight more. Stay with me, kids. Eight. Two. Hold it up there. Five, four, three, two, one. And lower. Go ahead and push yourself. Oh, we're going to kick it forward. And bring it back and point. Flex and kick. Bring it back and point. Flex and kick. Bring it back and point. Abs in. You're not rocking. Last one. Feel the love here. Remember that band is just an option. So, bend those knees. Push yourself up. Let's bring the band above the knees. Knees in. Heels together. Lift lower. As you lift. Eight more here. Four, three, two. Hold it up there to three balls. Stay with me. Eight. Three, two, one. Last set. Eight, seven, six, four, three. Hold and squeeze, keep breathing. Five, four, three, two, one, and lower. Good. Push yourself up. Go ahead and get rid of those bands. I want to thank you all for joining me this morning. We have our live class Tuesday and Thursday mornings right here out on the green. Sit up nice and tall, shoulders above your hips. Inhale here, bring those arms up, lend that body. Palms come together, exhale and slowly lower. And join us for other YouTube videos at our YouTube channel at LWCA Fitness. And we'll see you next time. Thank you so much.